Welcome to Sal's Classic Bodybuilding Archives. In today's episode, we're going back to September 1965, Mr. America Magazine. My Secrets for Building Wide Shoulders by Don Howard. Enjoy. I have read many articles on deltoid training in all of the various bodybuilding publications during the past few years. Most of these articles have neglected what I believe is the key issue, with. It is true that the various routines do help the bodybuilder add size to his delts, but seldom if ever is there any consideration for shoulder structure. I first became conscious of shoulder width when I met Steve Reeves several years ago when he was training director for American Health Studios. Steve not only pointed out the importance of deltoid training to me, but he particularly emphasized working the structure. Just look at any picture of Reeves and notice the wide clavicles and the perfectly rounded delts that taper down to that small waist. Truly a magnificent shoulder spread and in my opinion, the most impressive of all time. Steve gave me several exercises and suggestions on shoulder width which changed my whole training concept. From that time on, exercises for the shoulders became the most important in my training program. The deltoid is composed of three heads or bellies, the anterior which is the front, the lateral or the side, and the posterior, the rear. Specialization on exercises that work the lateral head of the deltoids will greatly increase the width and appearance of the shoulders. Here is the exact program that I used to add one and a quarter inches in shoulder width in a little over a month. It is a tough program, but it really works. 1. Press behind the neck. Here is the most important exercise in the program. This movement works the structure like no other and must be performed exactly as outlined for the best results. Grasp a barbell with a wide grip as shown in illustration number one. Although I am seen standing, I prefer to perform this movement while seated to prevent cheating. 2. One arm press. Here is a great one for adding bulk to the lateral head of the deltoid. Grip a support of some type with your left hand for balance as you press the dumbbell overhead with the right hand. Be sure to lock out the arm completely at the top and count two before doing the next rep. Perform eight reps with each arm, then go immediately to exercise number three, the side incline raise. This movement, when properly performed, will thicken the outer head of the deltoids quickly. Lying on the side of an incline bench with the dumbbell not quite touching the thigh, slowly raise the dumbbell upward as far as you can. Here's the important point. As the bell is being raised, turn the hand so that the little finger is pointing upward toward the ceiling. This thoroughly peaks and contracts the deltoid. After completing 8 reps for each delt, immediately go back to exercise number 2, the one arm press, and perform another set. You will perform 4 sets of each exercise in this superset style before going on to exercise number 4. Number 4. Dumbbell Press Now that the deltoids are really pumped from the last superset, more structural work is called for. Starting with two dumbbells at the shoulders, press them overhead to full lockout. Number five, 
three-way side raises. Here is a great pumper to really flush the shoulder region and give you a maximum pump. Raise the dumbbells from the thighs to shoulder height. Pause briefly, then lower and repeat for five reps. Part two of this great exercise is done by starting with the dumbbells at shoulder height and slowly raising them all the way overhead for five reps. Immediately perform the third part of this exercise, which is done by starting with the dumbbells at the thighs and raising them all the way overhead for five reps. Be sure to perform all three parts of the exercise before resting. Perform five sets of 15, five, five, and five, will really make the deltoids ache and burn. The real clincher for adding shoulder width is to immediately follow up the shoulder program with lat work. The best exercise for working the lats and the terrace major is the two arm chin. Perform 10 sets of 10 reps of the wide grip chin in front of the neck. Use as wide a grip as possible to really stretch the shoulder girdle. If you are unable to do the full 10 reps on every set at first, do as many chins as possible and then finish off with as many half chins as needed to complete the set. Finish off your last workout with five sets of 10 reps of wide grip bent over barbell rowing. Take a shower and go home to a big protein meal. When specializing on shoulder width, you must not overwork the rest of your body. Here is the way I found it produced the best results. It is important to realize that you must get eight hours of sleep every night in addition to eating a diet rich in protein to make maximum gains. Broad shoulders command the respect of everyone and they are the mark of a man. Look your best in clothes, on the beach, or on the posing platform with wide shoulders and thick delts. This is how I built my wide shoulders. Muscle up, you're in the weeder generation. Well, thank you for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Please leave a like, a comment, share, and subscribe. I would appreciate it. And until the next video, keep training and chasing the dream.